right guys, this is the makeup look for today for the wedding. It's literally exactly what I did the other day, except a little bit more coverage of a foundation. And I smudged a little brown um, eyeliner. It's kind of hard to see because I put it on on the upper lash line and then I um, buffed some bronzer in instead of eyeshadow and it just gives like a soft defined look without it being like poof, eyeliner because I'm not a big eyeliner wearer. So that's the look. Now uh, let's go put the outfit on. All right. Here's the outfit. We have a, this is a thrifted snake print um i just like to have three quarter sleeves when i'm working i can't have full long sleeves when i'm doing makeup i don't know so we have this snake skin print vintage liz claiborne turtleneck that i obviously thrifted i pulled my normal daily gold jewelry out and then this is a really fun olive green corduroy jumper from the 90s and i've got it on with black tights we're gonna put some mules on throw a coat over this is the outfit of the day. Very thrifted, librarian chic. It seems to be my style right now, librarian chic. It's just what I'm always going for. So I just have my hair back in a clip from Target. I think it's like a Kristen S clip, I want to say. Something like that. But it's the look. I'm obsessed. I've been, I've been wanting to wear this jumper. I forgot about it and I haven't worn it in like probably a year. So or two years maybe even. So I'm very excited to wear today. All right, that's the outfit. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you after the wedding. Okay, I threw on this gray blazer as a coat and I wanted to show you these are my shoes. They're, they have such a thick, comfortable sole, but they're just brown loafers and I threw them on with the outfit. All right, now we're really gonna go to the wedding. Hi, it is much later now. It's Saturday, um, four o'clock. Whew, looks like it's a lot brighter out than it actually is. I was just clearing off my dining room. I bought this paper towel holder from Amazon and it worked so great for like two months. And now it's just given up hope and it keeps falling. So I'm gonna throw that out. We're done with it, we're over it. Anyways, I'm hosting a cookie exchange tomorrow at my house. I have five of my friends coming over and we're all making cookies and we're gonna exchange them so that, you know, we can have a bunch of different kinds of Christmas cookies. And then I'm like prepping a few little treats for them. So I, the rest of my vlog today is going to be making the cookies, prepping for their little... Hi, it is much later now. It's Saturday, um, four o'clock. Whew, looks like it's a lot brighter out than it actually is. Um, I was just clearing off my dining room. I bought this paper towel holder from Amazon and it worked so great for like two months and now it's just given up hope and it keeps falling. So I'm gonna throw that out. We're done with it, we're over it. Anyways, I'm hosting a cookie exchange tomorrow at my house. I have five of my friends coming over and we're all making cookies and we're gonna exchange them so that, you know, we could have a bunch of different kinds of Christmas cookies. And then I'm like prepping a few little treats for them. So I will be showing you um, the rest of my vlog. The rest of my vlog today is going to be making the cookies, prepping for their little gifts. Um, but let's talk about the wedding. I had a wedding this morning and it was amazing. Like, I, I don't know why I'm still surprised how happy I am when I leave weddings sometimes. <laughs> like, doing this for eight years, I love weddings, okay? And I just, I don't know, I'm just always so amazed how I can meet somebody and literally for the second time, and like their bridesmaids, meet their bridesmaids the day of their wedding. 
and we're just, I leave being like, oh, I love you all. And like, they all wanted to, they were like, can we hug you before you leave? It was just like, oh, so magical. It was such a good day. Um, head to my Instagram because I'm probably gonna post a photo of her makeup soon. It was so pretty. I loved it. I loved every moment of today. It was good. Um, but now, I don't know if you can hear my laundry in the background, but my little gifts that I have for my ladies coming tomorrow. I have some vintage blankets that I thrifted from an estate sale in October. And I wanted to give everybody a little something tomorrow. And I'm, I had these vintage blankets and I was like, you know what? I don't need to keep five vintage blankets. Like I bought them with the intention of, I should have these on hand in case I ever like want a special little gift for someone or like somebody moves into a new house, I have a little housewarming gift, whatever. So I bought them with that intention. And then as I was looking at them, I was like, wait a minute, there's five of these. And uh, I have five friends coming tomorrow. So it just seemed like it made perfect sense that I gift them all one. So I am just giving them a quick wash right now so that they're nice and refreshed. And then I'm gonna wrap them cute with an ornament for all of them. I'm super excited. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna show you, I'm making cheesecake cookies for the cookie exchange. So we'll make those later together. Um, I can't remember where I saw it in somebody's YouTube video. I saw this recipe and I'm gonna try them tonight. So we're gonna make cookies together. Um, yeah, I'm just tired. I took a little nap after my wedding, which I like to do. I might make a nice coffee here in a moment, but for now I'm gonna, honestly, I'm gonna sit on the couch right now because I just did a little cleaning. I'm gonna sit on the couch and finish up my book that I've been wanting to finish up. I have like 20% left. And uh, I'm just gonna read it right now. Let's just finish the book, so. I'm also like really thirsty today. Again, I get super thirsty on wedding days because I've, I talk so much. I know, that's like probably really hard to believe, isn't it? That I talk a lot on wedding days. But um, yeah, that's the plan for the day. Christmas fun, baking, sitting by the Christmas lights. It's the cozy season. Here's what I found. Oh, my iPhone just showed me 83 holiday desserts that I absolutely have to try. Does anyone else's Apple Watch do that? I must have some feature on where like if I start talking and raise my hands, because it happens to me all the time at weddings where it just like thinks I'm asking it a question and it records everything. Yeah, it's really annoying. Um, okay. Let's, uh, let's finish a book. Yeah, let's read. See you in a little bit gifts um but let's talk about the wedding I had a wedding this morning and it was amazing I I don't know why I'm still surprised how happy I am when I leave weddings sometimes <laughs> like doing this for eight years I love weddings okay and I just I don't know I'm just always so amazed how I can meet somebody and literally for the second time and like their bridesmaids meet their bridesmaids the day of their wedding and we're just, I leave being like, oh, I love you all. And like, they all wanted to, they were like, can we hug you before you leave? It was just like, oh, so magical. It was such a good day. Head to my Instagram because I'm probably gonna post a photo of her makeup soon. It was so pretty. I loved it. I loved every moment of today. It was good. But now, I don't know if you can hear my laundry in the background, but my little gifts that I have for my ladies coming tomorrow, I have some vintage blankets that I thrifted from an estate sale in October. And I wanted to give everybody a little something tomorrow. And I am I had these vintage blankets and I was like, you know what? I don't need to keep five vintage blankets. Like I bought them with the intention of, I should have these on hand in case I ever like want a special little gift for someone or like somebody moves into a new house, I have a little housewarming gift, whatever. So I bought them with that intention. And then as I was looking at them, I was like, wait a minute, there's five of these. And uh, I have five friends coming tomorrow. So it just seemed like it made perfect sense that I gift them all one. I am just 
giving them a quick wash right now so that they're nice and refreshed. And I'm gonna wrap them cute with an ornament for all of them. I'm super excited. Yeah. I'm gonna show you, I'm making cheesecake cookies for the cookie exchange. So we'll make those later together. I can't remember where I saw it in somebody's YouTube video. I saw this recipe and I'm gonna try them tonight. So we're gonna make cookies together. Yeah, I'm just tired. I took a little nap after my wedding, which I like to do. I might make a nice coffee here in a moment, but for now I'm gonna, honestly, I'm gonna sit on the couch right now because I just did a little cleaning. I'm gonna sit on the couch and finish up my book that I've been wanting to finish up. I have like 20% left and uh, I'm just gonna read it right now. Let's just finish the book, so. I'm also like really thirsty today. Again, I get super thirsty on wedding days because I talk so much. I know, that's like probably really hard to believe, isn't it, that I talk a lot. That's the plan for the day. Christmas fun, baking, sitting by the Christmas lights. It's the cozy season. Here's what I found. Oh, my iPhone just showed me 83 holiday desserts that I absolutely have to try. Does anyone else's Apple Watch do that? I must have some feature on where like if I start talking and raise my hands because it happens to me all the time at weddings where it just like thinks I'm asking it a question and it records everything. Yeah, it's really annoying. Okay, let's uh, finish a book. Yeah, let's read. See you in a little bit. All right guys, it's time to make some cookies. We're gonna make some cream cheese Christmas cookies that hopefully turn out cute. So I'll flip you around. We'll probably speed this up and uh, we're gonna make some cream cheese cookies. Yay.
these off camera because my battery's gonna die, but these are three of the blankets that, the vintage blankets that I got. So I just picked up a big set of these glittery pine cone ornaments from World Market and then some twine that's metallic and white. And I just rolled each of these up. I've got one for each friend that's coming. And yeah, they also get two ornaments. I'm so excited. I have two more that are getting washed right now, but um, you could do something really similar with like kitchen towels or pretty napkins. I just love this idea. Also, we have hot cocoa bombs. Oh, that's the timer for the cookies. Let's check them out. Yum, look how good those look. They actually like rose really high. They're so cute. They're like marbled and they have green sprinkles. Very Christmassy. I'm excited to taste one and I'll let you know tomorrow how they are. I hope you had a wonderful Saturday. And I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Good morning. Happy Sunday. Back with my reindeer mug. I love this little guy because it's like very 90s to me or 80s. I don't know. It just feels very like when I was a kid. I want to give you a quick tour of the house because it is Sunday morning. I think weekend vlogs are going to be condensed into one weekend. So like instead of me posting a vlogmas today, you're going to get days five and six on Monday. You know? Because I just have a busy, it's it's hard. I feel like it's better to do that than to put too much pressure on myself and then completely stop filming. So, it is Sunday morning. It's about, it's almost nine o'clock. And I have some friends coming over soon for a little cookie exchange. So I wanted to give you a little tour because I don't think I showed my holiday decor. I mean, you've seen my Christmas tree about a hundred times at this point. It's still doing that weird light thing. I don't know why. It's my Christmas tree, but let's, when you walk in the front door, I've got the little Christmas tree still. That's covered right now with keys, but it says Noel spelled with a G and there's gnomes on it, so it's funny. Um, we've got some lights over here or on the TV and some trees. That's obviously my area for my nieces and nephews. This is the couch currently. It's just some cozy pillows and blankets. And that's the candle from Bath and Body Works that I thrifted. That was like basically new. Over here, we have our record player and I'm about to, I just listened to it already once, but I'm about to play it again. Um, Leslie Adams, Simply Christmas. Love it, we have, this is Mikey and I little ornaments hanging from our art. You know, some little Christmas trees and things that my niece likes to play with, a Grinch card, some candles. Over here next to the tree, we have some Christmas trees, some vintage Christmas postcards, and then my brass reindeer that I love. Over here, though, is what I'm really excited about. So I have some, this says Merry and Bright, a garland with some gold beads that I added. And then I have some lights, or excuse me, I have some ornaments hanging from our light fixture, which is fun. Um, but this is the spread for this cookie exchange this morning. I've got some bagels, some cream cheese softening, and I'm gonna put some turkey out in case I wanna make a little breakfast bagel sandwich. Some blueberry muffins, some croissants, some mandarins fancy ones, you know, just as a little decor, but also like a snack. And then these are the blankets that I have for each friend that's coming. They're vintage blankets that I got at an estate sale. And I put little ornaments on them so that they can put those on their tree. So that's the table. Back here behind the table, we have some Santa and Holly Christmas mugs. We have hot cocoa bombs. That I'm very excited about. Then over here we have the space for the cookies. I just laid some fun towels out and these are the cookies I made yesterday. So my cream cheese, they're like marbled cookies. There we go. They're fun with little green sprinkles some fun Christmas napkins, more mandarins, and then everybody else will put their cookies out here. So that is the plan. We're just gonna have a fun Christmas morning with some 
hot cocoa, coffee, and treats. Little brunchy things. All right, I gotta light some candles and I'll talk to you later.